right. Good morning, YouTube. It's been a been a week, week and a half. God, I missed you guys. Not really, but I'm just kidding. <laughs> um, welcome back to the poetry section. I'm starting a new section or new playlist. Hopefully soon, which will be about records and uh, metal. And uh, all of that jazzy good stuff, or heavy good stuff in this case. So, keep out for that. And, um, let's see, what other updates do I have for the YouTube community? Nothing. Nothing. So, without further ado, I have a new poem for you guys today. And I hope you like it. This one is called Window, and I will talk about it after I read it, as always. <clears throat> so without further ado, let me present to you Window. I press my mind towards this window, staring out into the beyond, and I see my reflection. But I don't see me. I see a mask, a mask full of toxic gas, full of the worries of life, the stress of deadlines, possessed with fees and fines, beaten by my guilt. Wondering of what I could have built, this window clear it was supposed to be, but all I saw was a reflection of a failed life, an image without filters, raw. What an interesting window. So, I wrote this short poem, I guess it's considered, um, when uh, I was driving back from, I think, the store with a uh, a friend of mine, a friend of mine, and um, we were just venting about problems in our daily lives, and I just stared out the window and I saw all the things people did, and all the things we chose to ignore, and I thought that was really interesting how. No matter where we stand, racially, ethnically, politically, financially, we all have the same ending, which is death. But I found it interesting how if you pull yourself out of the human equation and you just observe everyone around you, it's interesting seeing them function like I don't know it's it's interesting like for me what I do sometimes when I'm in that type of mindset I'll be with a group of friends and I'll sit there but I will I won't really be into the conversation I'll more likely just be like observing them and I'll pull myself out of the equation and see what one person cares about while others care about something else and seeing the differences instead of the similarities that makes this group interesting and I'll go from there I don't know I've always found it quite interesting how humans are very perceptive and it's always funny how like in my case in particular I always get told that I'm very selfish and once I actually like pull myself out, I see everyone is selfish. Some of us just do a better job of either embracing it and not caring or hiding it. Which I'm more of the embracing part. So yeah, I just thought that was interesting. So this poem is really just to see like a reflection into what lives everyone has that 
no matter at what you can't put a filter on your life and make it go away which is why the last part is kind of like talk it's like directing it to people who use a lot of like instagram or social media really in the sense of like editing the shit out of your pictures because it's a failed expression of life that's why i say it was a reflection of a failed life an image without filters raw raw is the key word because now i see you for what you are and that's the one thing people don't like to be seen as so yeah but anyways so this was window i hope you guys liked it leave a, a comment down below if i need to work on something still pretty new to all of this stuff and um you know some more interaction from the viewers to me would be appreciated and uh yeah i'll see you guys in a couple days or next week